Hello Kayami! Welcome to my channel! For today's recipe, I will be cooking cassava suman with two delicious fillings, makapuno and ubi jam fillings. Let's start by squeezing the liquid from grated cassava or yuca root crops. But first, I added a half cup of water to help squeeze the liquid of the cassava. Then using cheesecloth or kacha, I squeeze the liquid of the grated cassava. Do this with all the grated cassava, then set aside the liquid for about 20 to 30 minutes. Break up the grated cassava to loosen up before mixing other ingredients. Heat the banana leaves to be pliable, then clean and cut in your desired size. Let's go back to the liquid from grated cassava. Discard the liquid. You can see from the bottom the left starch from thinning the cassava. This will make your suman to be chewy. Then add the cassava starch to the grated cassava, followed by the light brown sugar, the condensed milk, the melted star margarine or salted butter then mix thoroughly until everything is incorporated Then wrap the mixtures on banana leaves. I make two tablespoons in every suman. I make first my cassava suman with makapuno fillings. Then wrap the rest of the suman for your makapuno fillings. Leave some for ubi fillings. To secure the suman, I tied the two cassava suman with banana leaf strings. Here's my cassava suman with makapuno fillings. The same with cassava suman with makapuno filling. I scoop two tablespoons of the grated cassava mixtures, but this time with ubi fillings.
Sisters, may kasaba suman with ube feelings. Arrange all kasaba suman in the pot. Fill with water. The water should be submerged the suman to cook evenly. Then steam the cassava suman in 45 to 60 minutes or until you can smell the good aroma of the cooked cassava. Here's my cassava suman with makapuno and ube fillings. If you like this video, don't forget to press the like button, write a comment, and subscribe! Thanks for watching guys! See you again next time! Bye!